Hey guys, Warrior here. Today, we'll be looking at another FLL passive techniques video on the channel. Today, we'll be looking at stiff and soft beams. So this is a stiff and soft beam. It can't be pushed this way because of this piece blocking it right here, but it can be pushed this way. Now, this is important in many cases where you need to take an object and push it one way, but make sure it doesn't come back on the other. An example of this is the elevator mission this year. So what our team did is we would have the robot drive up like this, and then the stiff side would push the elevator. After that, when the robot came back, it would be the soft side. So the elevator wouldn't budge. We found this efficient and useful because it takes no motors and it's highly accurate. To see a clip of this, again, watch till the end of the video, and we'll show you a clip of the robot doing that. Here's the other way you can use this passive technique in FLL. A second example of how this technique could be used in FLL is grabbing objects, such as this white building. We could have done it this year, but we found out since the building already scores points, it might not be as efficient. Instead, we decided to leave the building be. But our team did use this last year in the FLL Into Orbit Challenge to grab the core samples. Let's roll a clip of that. Hey you all, I hope this video convinced you how easy this technique is and how efficient it is when combined with other tasks in competition. I hope you use it to complete some of your own missions. Bye for now.